Dunedin residents won't be left alone this Christmas with the continuation of the community dinner. The long-time hosts retired last year, but the event has been picked up by the Acts of Kindness Charitable Trust, who also brought in this lovely hat for me. And Chairman Grant Hardy joins us to talk about it. Good evening, Grant. Good, hi, Rebecca. Now, where is the dinner being held this year? It's at the Town Hall in Murray Place. Very nice. So how many people can you take? 530. Wow. What's going to be on the menu? Well, we're having a lovely uh, traditional Christmas dinner menu of um, ham, roast hoggett, vegetables, new potatoes, uh, choice of um, plum pudding and custard or fruit salad and, and, um, and pavlova. Yeah. Very, Very nice. Tasty. And will there be any other festivities? Yes, there will. There will be uh, some spot prizes. We have around 50 or 60 spot prizes to give away. We have music. We have Peter Keisha playing the town hall organ and we have a, a choir and lots of fun, actually. Why is this community dinner important? It's important for people who are otherwise alone on Christmas Day, who don't perhaps have the family support. Um, it's, a, it's sort of a sad day. It's often promoted as a, as a family occasion for Christmas Day, and those that don't have it really feel that, I think. That's mm. our experience. Mm. And so, so. Uh, well, how is the Trust paying for the event? Grants and donations uh, from the community. Oh, that's wonderful, isn't it? How many people will be helping out on the day? We're having a bit over 100. Volunteers. All volunteers. Yeah, all oh, volunteers. That's wonderful. And who's doing the cooking? Well, we're having campus catering staff, some of those people coming along, plus other volunteers with kitchen experience. What's your role going to be on the day, Grant? My role on the day? Well, I'll be um, enjoying the occasion after months of hard work and um, just, you know, communicating with people and having a great time. Mm. Is this uh, it's the, the sort of event where anybody can just turn up on the day or do they need to book in advance? Preferably to book and that gives us an opportunity to, to perhaps gauge some numbers to see how we're going. We won't turn anybody away. It just may mean they don't get a seat. Mm. Um, have one of those seats. We prefer everyone to be seated but it just helps us a wee bit as well. Well, how can they book? They can book through uh, Council of Social Services, um, 471-6150, um, and uh, they'll uh, th through um, other, other day between about 8.30 and 5 o'clock. Mm. And is it free to attend or a gold Absol coin donation? Absolutely free. Absolutely free. Uh, no, no alcohol. Um, and not to bring alcohol as well, but it's an alcohol free thing. Well, there is the Christmas community spirit right there. Chairman of Acts of Kindness Charitable Trust, Grant Hardy, thanks very much for your time. Thanks very much, appreciate it.